Jackson Pollock was an abstract artist in the mid-1900s. Jackson Pollock was born on January 28, 1912, and was the youngest of five brothers. Pollock attended the Manuel Arts High School in Los Angeles, where he befriended Philip Guston, a famous abstract artist who would influence Pollock in this form of art. When Jackson was 18, he moved to New York City to live with his brother Charles, who was also an artist. Shortly after moving there, he went to an exhibit of Pablo Picasso at the Museum of Modern Art, which greatly changed his way of painting. Abstract art, like this painting by Picasso of three musicians, simply means art that doesn't look like anything realistic and is made up of different shapes, colors, and textures. This painting, called Going West by Pollock, is an example of abstract art because it looks surreal or imaginative. This is one of Pollock's earlier paintings, which is clearly abstract, with lots of lines, colors, and shapes that have no definite picture. While perfecting his abstract technique, Pollock met another abstract artist named Lee Krasner in 1941. The two were married in 1945 and were married for 10 years until Pollock's death in 1956. During this time, Jackson Pollock developed what he called the drip method, which is basically just splattering paint all over a huge canvas. The first painting he introduced using this method in 1950 was called Number One, or Lavender Mist. Pollock insisted that all of the splatters on his canvases were on purpose and not by accident, and that he had a method to it. Pollock became very famous, and his paintings can be found at museums around the world. Sadly, Jackson Pollock was killed in a car accident in 1956 when he was only 44 years old.